On March 6, the latest CCTV military program not only disclosed China's latest field air defense equipment Hongqi 17 ae but also used the title of the strongest field air defense artifact. The training ground noticed that compared with the previous Hongqi 17 series air defense missile, this latest type of field air defense weapon has the ability to launch into space, and the speed and flexibility of counterattack have been greatly improved. On the proving ground of Hongqi 17 AE, the program military armed zero range directly hit an experiment of missile launching on the move. After the experiment, the tank turned on the radar and ran several laps back and forth on the runway in order to better simulate the actual combat environment. Soon after, an orange drone took off. The number one spotted the target, and the azimuth was 236 degrees. The tracking was normal. Hongqi 17AE quickly found the target. After receiving the launch command, a missile whizzed up and flew towards the target aircraft. The whole process was less than 10 seconds. In the slow motion video, it can be seen that in the final stage of the missile rushing to the target, it is almost in a state of heading towards the target. In the meantime, the missile accurately adjusted its course several times, and the final fatal blow tore the target drone to pieces, demonstrating a very good terminal maneuverability. The Hongqi 17 series is born out of the Russian-made oil M1 air defense missile system. The missile vertical launch device, radar and photoelectric detection device are all installed on a combat vehicle, and the previous missile car, radar car and other vehicles the integrated huge system is in sharp contrast. In the late 1990s, China ordered a batch of Doyle M1 from Russia. At the beginning of this century, China developed the domestic-made Hongqi-17 air defense missile system on the basis of the Doyle M1 and it was put into service in the army in 2012, before the exposure of Hongqi 17 AE. The latest model of the series of air defense missiles was Hongqi 17 A, which debuted at the 2019 China National Day Military Parade. In terms of electronic equipment, the Hongqi 17 A has obvious upgrades and improvements compared to the previous model. Electronic scanning radar photoelectric devices and data antennas are significantly streamlined and optimized. In today's modern battlefield where precision-guided weapons are rampant, it can intercept combat aircraft, cruise missiles, air-to-surface missiles, anti-radiation missiles and other aerial targets entering the combat airspace, and prop up a mobile protective umbrella for troops in the field. In the program, the technicians of the Hongqi 17 AE can launch an attack at a distance of 15 to 20 kilometers from the target. The first generation mainly used high altitude aircraft, the second generation was mainly aircraft type targets, and the third generation was able to intercept cruise missiles and air to surface missiles. A tank guided four missiles, that is, four missiles can be launched at the same time to hit four targets. The original second-generation vehicle can only guide one target and hit one target. Yu Ben Shui, an academician of the Chinese Academy of Engineering and Missile Expert, concluded that in terms of combat capabilities, the third-generation tanks are already equivalent. In the capacity of five second-generation tanks, 